How you going, Leo? We're going to do your quick daily read and see what possibly comes out for your spiritual message. All right, I've been shuffling these cards for ages. You'll see that I do everything thoroughly from scratch. All right, we split the deck to make sure that they're completely random. Okay. It's going to give an outcome. It's going to go into the hopes and fears. Oh, somebody's trying to shut me down, huh? I don't like what I got to say. Fuck, get the fuck off my channel. Yep. Wow. I have no idea how spiritually guided and spiritually developed I am. Alright, as you'll see that I've got time reversals. Wow, somebody. Man, somebody's crying right now, eh? I don't know if you can see it, but there's a tear just come randomly out of my eye. See? Somebody is crying then right now. Somebody doesn't like what I'm saying. Somebody doesn't. Somebody's got to communicate something, man. I'm telling you the truth. Somebody has to communicate something. There's a random tear that just came straight out of my eye. See? All right. Anyway, let's get on with the reading. <coughs> Somebody is trying to shut me up. I don't care. I'm going to continue on. Nobody's going to stop my spiritual messages from coming out thoroughly. Yeah, release at the present moment. Somebody's been released. Something's been released. Something's breaking your heart. We can see that thoroughly and it needed to be released. That's the best way to say that because you know, there was no giving and receiving there. You are the abundance and you deserve everything in life. Okay, so you had to take action. You may have been dealing with somebody very, very egotistical that could not see the signs. Okay, so come straight back out, the giving and receiving, which is why we had to be released up here. Okay, there's no giving and receiving there and that's fair. Okay. All right, let's have a look here in itself. Man, I'm serious. Somebody's crying right now. Either you are hurting somebody with the things you're saying or doing, or somebody's hurting you in some sort of way because I've got, look at that, painful crisis. Somebody made you an option in some sort of way. Look at that light. And that random tear that just came out of my eye for no reason whatsoever tells I am a real empath. I'm a real one. Oh, wow. All right, let's get on with this reading, all right? I'll go through the reading quickly, all right? We're going to get this one out, out and done. Um, we've got extra cards for some reason. Yeah, man. Somebody's trying to shut me up, man. Somebody needs to communicate something. Somebody really, really needs to communicate something because you are absolutely blocking my throat right now. Like you're blocking, 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 thoroughly blocking my throat. Give me this protein. No, still there. You need to, somebody needs to communicate something. All right, here we go. Oh, wow. All right, you are the stability in yourself, all right? Yeah, I'm going to show you something. Emotionally, intuitively intelligent. This is the energy of the whole reading, which is these cards here, Leo, right? You can see that pentacle in the background. It shows you are the stability. Now, they are stability in itself. You're a diamond, all right? You're a diamond, and that's beautiful. The past is about to receive justice, all right? Any friends, family, lovers, any anything that was manipulating you in some sort of way that manipulated your love, all right? That couldn't see your value, couldn't see the stability within you. There is justice there, the justice in reverse too. So, and it does show that there. I'm about to read thoroughly what the justice in reverse means. Consequences for their actions, retribution in reverse. Consequences for their action, retribution, karma, injustice, and inequity. The opportunity to make changes that will better your future, though, but taking responsibility for their actions, learning from the past experiences. Somebody's facing regret at the present moment, or somebody's about to face regret from some sort of stability in some sort of way that should have been addressed and should have been seen. From the best way to say that, all right, what we're going to do here is I'm just going to make sure thoroughly from a completely different book. In reverse, just to make sure. Yeah, man, injustice. There's been, you've had to go through some sort of injustice through friends, family, something. There's multiple people in that thing, karmic and, karmic and somebody, because these are opposing energies to that. There's the stability and there's the justice that's coming in for that retribution, the, mora the morals. Somebody was not showing morals. Somebody wants to make up for the past actions. Somebody was judging you. 
and they should never have been doing that because now there's consequences to those actions. Look, if somebody doesn't want to see you as stability, somebody doesn't see you, because that's what that cut is, is knowing your worth. So it shows that you know your worth and you're not going to allow these people to put you down. You're not going to allow anybody to do it because you know you co-create with the divine and you know you give good things out to the universe and you don't deserve to be put down and treated like shit by illusion. The moon is things we can't see. So we can see a lot of emotion here. You've got a ten of pentacles coming, okay? It's fair in itself. Have a look underneath the energy, man. Look, we've got a counterpart here. And if somebody can't see that in itself, because we got giving and receiving here and it's upright. we got a king to a queen here as well. We have a, uh, look, if somebody can't see your worth, okay, even though they're a counterpart, even though that the universe could bring them to you, even though you could manifest it, whatever it is, they cannot, you have free will. They have free will. You cannot, maybe somebody's crying at the present moment because I, wow, there's like tears coming out of my eyes now for no reason. The weirdest thing you could ever possibly imagine is happening through this reading. And somebody's really trying to shut me up. All right, but we do have a counterpart, a king to a queen here, and then we've got love in the middle, okay? So a family. Does it make sense? But there's injustice there in itself, okay? It does show there's no giving and receiving in the past, and it does show why the justice is in reverse there because of retribution, making up for the past acts and consequences. But there's been a lot of judgment there that should never have been there, and they should have seen your worth in the first place, and we can see that you give and receive to the universe because these will go hand in hand with that. But if you're the counterpart, if you're the queen of cups, signs are relevant. But if you're male or female, all signs are irrelevant, okay? But it's a countership, a partnership full of love and trust and communication and beautiful things here. And we've got cups, cups, cups. We've got a stability in itself, giving and receiving like diamonds in itself. We can see the balances out though in itself. We can definitely see that. That's why the tower moment had to come around, man. There's some sort of um, stability, all right? It's the best way to say that. Something's going to shock you. There's a victory coming. It's going to shock you, all right? And it's coming in as a download because that's the crown but we can see the shot the shooting into that crown it's a download there is something coming in that's going to shock the fuck out of you and that's the best thing i can possibly say now there is a victory here in some sort of way okay and there is stability and there is giving and receiving but that justice is there and it's opposing energies for some sort of specific reason okay we've got that's these two cards go to hand in hand with friends family lovers something is manipulating you and it's out of balance. It's the best way to say that because they should be seeing your stability. They should be seeing you as that growth, okay? If you have something coming in you can't see at the present moment and it's going to shock the shit out of you because it's coupled with a victory. So that's beautiful in itself, like absolutely beautiful. Gonna have a look at the heart. Oh, wow, you are a fucking empress, man. Look at that. You are a real divine soul, man. You have... a love grow devotion beauty in that heart look at the heart there it needs to be protected you've got to protect your heart if somebody's making you competition or putting competition in your life protect that heart step just protect it okay because that's competition everybody's trying to fight for that light there in itself so just protect your heart because that's the four to the five in itself and we go from the three to the four to the five so it does show the progression as you go through as you're the empress man you are unconditional love and that is beautiful because that's how it's supposed to be in life you are unconditional love and have a look at the past leading up to it man there is somebody crying man the fuck is going on here if you are very very sad at the present moment just understand that spirit loves you very 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 much all right they're a butterfly the transformation is beautiful okay we've got the queen of cups here to the three of wands you were divinely guided from the past to step on because it's the same card here to the same card here does it make sense because there she is stepping on here with action, by the way, something was breaking your heart. We've got to be honest about it, okay? And that's why the tower moment's there. Something was breaking your heart, all right? Okay, you have a universal wish coming. You have a real universal wish coming, and spirit doesn't want you to ruin that, okay? And there's spirit there, the horrifying, okay? To watch over everything and keep it safe. That's why the Six of, so six of Swords is directly, divinely guided. It goes hand in hand with you stepping off, okay? You can see the footprints. There were shadows there in some sort of way that you couldn't see, okay? That's why the symbolic death of that transformation had to come around, which is the symbolic death in order to bring things, which is why something had to be, re re has had to be released. It's the best way to say that. What we're going to do is pull some cards, man. You're going through a horrible time in your life because I've got tower in that mindset. Just understand that there's a victory coming. And I understand that you may think that the broken hearts are going to be a thing of your future, but it's really not. You've got things coming in because these are what you can't see there. These go hand in hand with the outcome. But you give and receive to the universe, so you deserve what's coming in in the background there. You just can't see it at the present moment. And that's okay. You're working very, very hard on yourself, okay? 
and you're spiritually guided away because like I said, these cards go hand in hand with each other. You can see your strength is too beautiful. Okay? And you made the right choice. You may have been stagnant within that choice, but you're fearless to make that choice, okay? And you thought well within into your soul to know what you deserve and what you don't deserve, okay? And that's the best way to say that. You know your worth. I'm telling you the truth. That's what that card is. It's that card there in a different way. You knew your worth and you knew what you deserve. That's why the temperance angel is coming in. Now, when we lifted it up before, we've seen the moon, which is illusions, things we can't see. We've got all the illusions there in itself, okay? That's why spirit had to come along and balance that scale out, okay, and tell you to plan and step onto your future because we've got the two of wands to the three of wands. Two of wands is planning, three of wands is stepping onto your future, and we can see that whatever it was was breaking your heart from the past here, and life is too short. You know, we're going to get a wish here and there's making the wish upon the star in itself. So we don't want to break that heart in itself, okay? Because there was, look, I mean, I'm, I'm telling you the truth. We've got three, three, three in itself. There must have been multiple people in that relationship, multiple karmics, multiple choices, multiple judgments, multiple something, okay? And spirit comes around for a very specific reason, man, to make sure that these things don't hurt your heart. Because you're in your heart, it needs to be protected. Like I said, that's the heart of the reading. But look how protected the spirit is of your heart. It's a beautiful heart because you are an embodiment of that Empress energy, which is love and devotion. Which is why spirit says protect your heart from any competition and don't allow people to manipulate that heart. All right? And the whole thing is centered around you getting harmony leading into the future. Because the last card here is you is you making the right choice. And we got two, two to the two as well. So it shows you are making the right choice leading into the future. And we're surrounded by six. Sixes. sixes in numerology are love. Yeah, that's love, healing, relationships, family, and home. And it does show that into your crown. You know there's a, a victory coming, okay? And it's going to shock the shit out of you. And it's coming in fast. You can see that there. And it's a giving, receiving type of love, which is beautiful. Because in between that, I've got the family, okay? There was just injustices in the past. And they didn't see your worth, okay? But somebody tells me that in the future, they're going to see the right perspective. The hangman needs to be turned the right way. But eventually, that hangman will be turned around the right way in itself, okay? Because everything was that wheel card there for good fortune coming in, okay? Everything is fated to happen in life, okay? And if somebody wants to come around and be a player, because there's a Knight of Cups in reverse, somebody wants to be come around and be a player, narcissist, play on your mind, manipulate you, something like that, it's not worth it. It's just generally not worth it. You have 100 years to live on the planet, depending on how, how you treat your body and how you step towards your level levels of consciousness and your chakras and lining those heaven up and getting everything aligned. And, and the best part about it is you learning your worth, okay? It didn't come easy. You had to work very, very hard at it. Maybe they, maybe they didn't see that, okay? And that's fair, but that's why the justice is out there in itself, okay? And that's why we've got completion here. Past deceptions. It's even upright right now. Deception, lies, trickery. Somebody was lying to you. It's the best way, but it's completed now because the world is there, but it does show somebody was deceiving you. Thoroughly, and we've got the broken heart. Whatever it was, it was deceiving you and it was breaking your heart, okay? Because there's deception, taking only what they needed. They were being strategic about it. They were steering, you were steering clear of dishonesty and manipulation, which is magnificent, but there was some sort of stealth. There was something you can't see. It's the best way to say that, and I'll get a second opinion on that because we got the justice, which is out of balance in itself. So something was out of balance there. And so if you made the right choice, but yeah, you can, you can indicate deception, trickery, taking only what's needed. They're completely different book. The universe bearing witness to someone's true intentions, which is why justice is there. Because you've got to understand, this is the energy of the whole reading. This is the past leading to it. This is the future coming away from it. This is what we can't see. There's the thoughts in the heart. We haven't had a look at these, but this is the reading here. These two cards are you, if that makes sense. You knowing your worth. And it's the first card there. And then underneath that is you knowing your worth and how far that, because it's the same card there to the same card there. So it shows and how far you've stepped in your journey to make the right decisions. Okay. So you're not trapped in life. Okay. Because of broken hearts but you're fearless and strength is absolutely beautiful because the strength card is right next to that and there was a lion right in that corner, which is why you come full circle and complete these deceptions out. Look at the heart there. See the heart there? It's stabbed with a knife. Look at it being protected over here. Spirit protects your heart thoroughly. This is why you complete these things out. New levels of awareness in itself because look at that heart, man. Somebody's treating you like an option. Somebody was treating you like an option and spirit's seen everything, which is the horrifying there in itself, but spirit's seen everything, man. That's beautiful to be that protected in life, okay? You made the right choice and that's clear communication. Yeah, man, that's why the tower moment, surrounded by tower moments, complete these things out and just know that you deserve what you're worth. Spirit's got your back, see? See how her head's just sticking out there, but the but the bath she's in is the universe. So Spirit's got your back, okay? It'll shock, it'll shock the world, what's about to happen in your world, okay? But no more juggling, man. Nobody will ever juggle you and that's fair, okay? That's 
disgusting as you've got your goggles on, you've got your eyes on, your learning curve in itself, and you can see you've made the right choice, but you're just learning in life, okay? You will be never be juggled, and that's your strength, okay? And it's divinely guided that you heal, okay? Because whatever has happened in the past, it only grew you to be who you are as a soul, and that's why you had to complete it out and step on, because, step on because of the deception. We can see you'll have a victory coming into the future because you know your worth. They might not be able to see it. Look, you know your worth, and it's the same card here, and it's the same card of why the justice is there. They may not be able to see your worth, but you know your worth. They can sit there and look at those three cups as much as they want, as much as they want. But they, if they can't see the cup that you are, what's the point? What's the point of any of it? And that's fair because there's the harmony in itself because you're free. See the harmony and see she's free there to have inner peace. And that's what you are in itself. You're free to plan for your future, okay? And not be ostracized and not be left out in the cold, not be homeless, not be put down, okay? Because these things have broken your heart thoroughly before and you've worked very, very hard for hope in the future. Very, very hard because you are the empress. Like I said, it's in your heart, but it's also you can't break an empress's heart. Look, there's a broken heart with the three of swords, three of swords, three of swords, which is a broken heart. And there's the Empress with the, the healing that heart from conflict in itself. And the conflict is the competition somebody had you in. Uh, we've got Hope here. Uh, and there's Hierophant there bringing that wish in, okay? There's Hierophant, which is the guru within in order to bring them wishing. We've got teamwork in some sort of way, okay? And that's why the justice is there. There were three people there in some sort of way. There was multiple people in some sort of way in the past here, which is why the justice is in reverse and the justice is on your side leading into the future in itself, okay? Because of the illusions. We can, I can do, go back through the reading and have a look. The same way I pulled this, as soon as I go around this justice, there's illusions. That's what the moon is. The moon highlights things we can't see in itself, okay? And there's divine inspiration. You're trusting your third eye, which is beautiful as you're fearlessly moving towards yourself as a soul. And you've gone well within your soul. You don't need this shit in your life, man, especially from any lovers, manipulation, or any type of connection in itself, okay? And it's, it's surrounded by that illusion. And that's why it had to be released. You had to put action. Because he's sitting on Mars there. Action as you step towards. You do have a victory coming in. It's going to shock the shit out of them. But if they can't see your worth, fuck right off. I've got no time for this shit. I don't think anybody does. Temperance angels there to watch over everything, keep it safe because the six of wands. And this is the best way to say that with the empress underneath it. Look, that's that card there. They're surrounded by the shock that's about to come into your world, the foundations that are about to be rocked. And there's the world in between those foundations of the two towers. They're about to be rocked in itself. And we can see that there. You can see you have to complete things out because there's the reef of that world in order to bring in the celebrations and happiness. And there's you as an empress. And nobody should be fucking making an empress like that. Divine judgment has been laid because of the seven of swords, which is a deception. See the seven of swords, deception. And it hinders your growth in any way. There's clarity there. And your connection to spirit is absolutely beautiful. So you will sit on that solid foundation. You will lock your cups away and you will cut them down with morals. You will cut them down with integrity. And you, because you are learning in life and that's fantastic as you ascend in life, but you are the abundance and don't ever forget how beautiful you are because there's the lion and there's that light that shines straight. Do see the shot light, light that comes down straight onto you, Empress, in itself, and it shows your heart is beautiful. So protected at beautiful times, Leo, and that's magnificent. Well, let's have a look at the world. This is other people's opinions. Look, they were manipulating. I'm telling you the truth. Look at the tears. There's no love there. Look, the cup, cups are upside down. See? Look at the tears. Look at the illusions. Look at the manipulation playing on that mind. Yeah, look at it playing on that mind in the corner there. That's the manipulation in itself, okay? And that's why the justice is there. Thank you, Spirit, for the signs in the background. I'll let the cult collective know exactly what's going on here. But 100%, you're being manipulated in some sort of way and it was making you sad and the illusions were there in itself. So you can literally release that and you can trust the divine guidance that you are basically being told the truth okay because of the symbolic death of the endings that needed to take place because you give and receive to the universe they may not see that about you because they can't seem to see your worth but that's okay spirit does because we got another three there and it's also the same card here spirit does see that growth that you've had which is magnificent let's have a look at the hopes and fears in itself yeah look at that same card here same card here same card here it's the best way to say it. hold on to your value hold on to your truth hold on to who you are as a soul as a soul the best way to say it is in your future it is your stability to have that stability regardless what anything regardless what anybody wants because that four to the four shows because it puts emphasis here on this as to why this justice is here because there's the same card there to the same card there so this may put emphasis as to why the uh, retribution needs to be paid is because of this four here which is they can't see you as a blessing and if they can't see you as a blessing it's time to fuck off it's the best way to say that as you plan into your world because in between that in between that and this card here is that four of swords, which is uh, four there. And then there's the two of wands in itself right there. And in between that is spirit watching over everything with all the choices that were made. And it's the best way to say that. You have a choice in some sort of way coming into the future and you can hope for that, but it's planning for that future. Somebody's planning in some sort of way with hope. They may see your value coming into the future, but um, at the present moment, um, spirit's just saying, be you. 
and yeah, everything's fated to happen the way it's supposed to. You're supposed to, you're about to get a wish, okay? So just remember that and just trust the divine guidance. You're about to get a wish, okay? It comes in divine timing, but it will come straight in, okay? And that's the best way to say that. Let's have a look at the outcome because it goes hand in hand with what's coming in here in the background. Now, I'm telling you the truth. You have love coming in. You've got love coming in because there it is coming in the background and there it is from the Alpha to the Omega of Cups. It shows you a person that's learned the lessons as to who you are as a soul and that beautiful countership in itself and it's inevitable regardless, okay? Whatever's from the past, there's going to be a lot of sleepless nights, worry, anxiety because they're about to see you get that wish. But that's unfortunate, man. That, that's the choices they want to make in life man. and that's that's fair. You, you've got to do what you got to do, boo. And that's for it because see the choices here, the two of swords, the choices that they made here in itself and that's their cards. You can see why they've done it in itself, okay, and why spirits shut it down because of the deception. See, there's seven of swords. Deception, it's come back out again. It's just here in itself. That's why That's why judgment's there in itself and that's why justice there with clarity in itself is the deception. Look, sneaking up like that in itself. Look at the two-faced individuals. Look at the promiscuity in itself okay but that's okay you put boundaries into the future and that's your joy leo in itself and it does show that you're you are the happiness and positivity leaving leading into your future in itself what we're going to do is split the deck look at the manipulation here man and it's telling you being manipulated in your world some say or sort of way but you put an ending to it and that's beautiful absolutely beautiful what we're going to do is um finish this reading off um, and what we do is pull, pull a couple of cards just to clarify everything, okay? Because yeah, whatever that was, they can't see your worth, okay? But you know your worth. You know who you are as a soul, and it's beautiful. Like here, it's the same fucking cards here. Four, four, right? And then four. This is the best way to say this card. They can't see it. They want to reject the divine blessing that's offered. Go for it. That's the divine blessing. See the divine blessing in the outcome? See the Ace of Cups? That's the Ace of Cups in the outcome. You're the, you're the divine blessing. They can't see it in itself and that's okay because i've got the four to the four to the four and it's also up here as well so you know you that you're a divine blessing in itself because you worked on yourself and they want to leave you out in the cold then fantastic you've been homeless and probably been put down a literal a whole lot in your future and in your past sorry because it is in the future here but it shows that you're planning right now to make sure that doesn't happen in itself and the justice is there because of the devil it's the devil in the world there the justice is there in reverse and there'll be consequences for those actions in itself leading into the future all spirits saying it's here at the present moment in the world okay so you can know your worth same cards keep coming out make sure you know your worth okay and here you are the empress same cards keep coming out from a completely fresh deck and we have only pulled two cards out of it so this is a definite message for somebody okay now that tear that come out of my eyes at the start there was a bit up there so i just need you to understand that spirit is 100 percent with you and holding your hand right now okay good fortune growth and expansion is coming into your life and i can see it just because of your heart alone and your heart is beautiful okay so you can get these things be enthusiastic man i'm telling you the truth it's the hardest thing in the world be enthusiastic as you charge towards that pursuit of who you are as a soul there is a cup coming in okay and that's fantastic okay but you can't see it at the present moment the things of the past man there was a lose in there in itself and it broke your heart in itself that's why spirit had to guide you away from it see it's the same card there to the same card there to the same card there as you can literally see the spirit guiding you away if you were an intuitive reader you could see that there thoroughly and the same card there to the same card there to the same card there to the same card there as you're spiritually guided away because to walk away see cards don't lie in itself you're the fool on the journey you've got to be treated with respect and you've got to be treated with love and that's what spirit spirit is there is to give guidance a thorough guidance uh, through me in order to make sure that you don't get fucked over in life again because we can't have that you're a divine blessing it's literally see this see that that's what it is it's a gift from god see the hands of god it's the hand of god offering a cup see them rejecting it because they couldn't see your worth in itself and it's in your crown and there's spirit there right there You're yeah, right next to you, watching over the devil manipulate you in some sort of way. But you have joy coming in and positivity coming into your future, all right? All right, let's have a look at this future, Leo. Cut them down with your morals. Cut them down with your integrity. You're a beautiful soul. Just remember how far you've come and grow and how much you've learned in your life. Just remember that. Anybody from the past comes back, cut them down with your morals. Cut them down with your integrity. And show integrity and morals, you know, and that's clear communication. The Queen of Swords is uh, settling calamity. So maybe somebody may be coming back to settle calamity in some sort of way, but you are learning as you're the soul. Something that you completed out and releasing those burnings too because tens of completions as well where there's no giving and receiving. You're the, you're the fool on the journey, which is magnificent. We'll now have a look at this heart here we'll make sure that um cards are all shuffled the heart man protect your heart i'm telling you that you're a kind confident warm person nobody should be deceiving you in that world because whatever it was was hurting you 
okay? You boldly express yourself and you don't ever unapologetically be yourself, ever. You'll always break, turn up and be you and you just put, keep putting your confidence and your heart in And because this is a cut of helping others as you build your queendom, your kingdom with power, intensity and love and it's in the heart. So you just always turn up and boldly express yourself. If people don't like you and they can't see your worth, tell them to fuck right off a thousand times over. But yeah, there's no more manipulation into your world because you're free now. See from the world, that's you learning the lesson so you can free in your world to be unapologetically you and give and receive to the universe. I'm talking to a charitable mind, so I'm talking to somebody lovely. So our spirit's saying, just know your worth and release any burdens, okay? So it just doesn't play because that's your victory at the present moment, okay? Because you walked away for a very, 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 very specific reason and you walked away fast. I'm not playing these games anymore with people. All right, let's have a look at the outcome there because you are a divine blessing and nobody should be deceiving that. me it's the same card here that broke your heart right there of the stabbing in the back but they're going to see you get a beautiful connection in the future okay you deserve it it's the same card here to the counterpart to the counterpart okay your heart is beautiful all right you have a counterpart coming in okay you're just learning at the present moment and there's clarity in itself okay because i've walked away from a lot of things but well, we've got two more cards to put on that but you've been fearless all right you've been strength strengthening yourself your heart is beautiful i'm telling you the truth and there's spirit there to make sure of it in itself. And that's why it had to be divinely guided away. There is judgment for these things of the past. And therefore, their deception. The best way to say that. Same card there, the same card there. The same card that's even in the outcome. So you will see the judgment. You will see the, deceit, the deception. Spirit's just saying put boundaries in place to any four to two-faced individuals. But there's the deception. Okay, it's a victory to walk away from that. Because there's the reef of completing that out. And in order to get that justice come in. And you made the right decision. Because you learned the trials and tribulations of what life's all about. Yeah, and that's the best way to say that. Nobody should be manipulating you or playing on your mind or allowing you. If they can't see your worth, go away. There's plenty of fish in the fucking sea. There's 8.5 billion people in the country, in the fucking world. Have a lovely, beautiful day. Take care and God bless.